When the first atomic bomb detonated in 1945, scientists expected destruction. But they didn't expect new minerals to appear in the ruins. At Ground Zero in New Mexico, the sand melted into a glowing, glassy substance. The heat from the blast hotter than the surface of the sun fused quartz, feldspar, and silica together into something the world had never seen before. They called it trinitite. But here's where it gets even stranger. Inside that trinitite, researchers later found brand new mineral structures, formed only because the explosion released pressures and temperatures impossible to create in any normal laboratory. Some samples even had microscopic metallic spheres, tiny droplets born from vaporized cables, buildings and soil frozen in midair by the shock wave. And the wildest part? These minerals are now used to help scientists identify nuclear explosions, even years after they happen. A single bomb didn't just change history. It literally changed the geology of Earth.